Fulfill your destiny! Alright, and here we have Satan. Now, this is where I think the description <laughs> of Satan, or Lucifer, apparently he is Lucifer, um, will alter slightly from the poem. Because I was able to see that, yeah, he does indeed have three faces. Um, so that's kind of cool. He's not chewing on anyone, but he does have the three faces as stated in the Inferno. And um, I believe it is, it is said that he is crying from one. At least one, if not all three. And um, uh, he is frozen up uh, like waist deep in ice. And he is at the very center of the circle of treachery, and so essentially at the center of hell. All of in all of hell, he is the very center. So that's pretty cool. But then I'm pretty sure that um, that the real Dante Alighieri didn't uh, describe him as having a huge swinging dick like he does in this iteration. And I mean, come on. It's a little ridiculous. Like, is it because they had like gratuitous boob that they had to have like gratuitous um what's it called? Like penis at the end? I mean, I don't know. Luckily, this is the only I guess nude male that we see in the game. But like, good god, it's so prominent. Look, it's that shit's down to his knees. <laughs> Oh man! All right, I'm done looking. Let's just let's just try to kill him. I think for a lot of this, your using his using your cross will see it's still damaging him. But for a lot of it, it actually after a while it just starts to hurt you. It doesn't hurt him anymore. I don't know why. I don't know if it actually is still hurting him, and I'm just not noticing that. Come on, fucking cut it out. Oh shit. Okay, let's fucking. Jesus Christ. Stop it. <laughs> this guy's like just throwing a tantrum. Why am I biblical now? Why is that the like notation under my account? Usually, is it only in this battle? Usually, he'll, it'll say exalted or. Divine? Is it divine and exalted? I'm not sure. I always thought that that had to do with your weapon, like which one you're using. So like the cross will have a different one and the scythe has a different, but I really have no idea. I don't know what that's about at all, like really, really at all. So don't quote me on that. Uh, if you want to figure it out, you can um, just Google it or whatever. Shit. <laughs> But, um, uh, what's it called? I forget what I was going to say. Something about the things. Oh, yeah, I just, I don't know what biblical means now. Unless it has something to do with the divine armor, which I don't think it would. Can you fucking get the hell? Oh, shit. Okay, good. And... Can you just stop it, please? Hopefully this will go okay. Although I'm not totally amped for this. <laughs> this battle is like, it's, it's a lot more of the same. If you would stop doing this, I'd be very fucking happy. Because this is just starting to piss me off. But I mean, this battle, like, I feel like it just lasts longer and he attacks. His attacks aren't necessarily any stronger than other enemies, but he does attack faster. Some of them are harder to avoid. And I should actually start healing again before I get, like, stuck in a weird loop. Um, but he just has the most health out of everyone. This is the final boss of the game, so it makes sense. But um, I'm just like, really, um, let's calm down a bit here. We don't need to be going nuts all the time, like how he is. And I don't know if you can block any of his moves. There's either a... R oh, well, that's nice. It's helpful. There's either a relic or an upgrade where you can 
block previously unblockable attacks. I don't know if that will count for Satan too, or Lucifer or whatever. Um, can you fucking just stop it? I don't know what you're doing. This is not working. That's hard to avoid. <laughs> and you can't block it. I don't know if you ever will be able to. Let's just hope that I can get another... done far worse than I. I stood for my fellow angels, for reason and justice, and then he made you in his image. You, the flawed creation, and I was to bow down to you. My gratitude for breaking the chains of Judeca. You don't Behold your ruin, and witness my escape into the kingdom of purgatory and paradise! I'm at the morning star! Alright, I don't know what I'm doing now. Oh, okay, I just gotta, like, bring myself back up to him. Luckily, if you get to this point, you get a full magic and health, uh, re like, regeneration, so that's good. Can I just keep? Do I just keep? Uh, might have been a little preemptive, but anyway. Um, yeah, I can't believe that this entire time we were, and I didn't notice either, that we were just breaking his chains um, in hell. Or not in hell, but obviously, yes, the chains in hell. Uh, but yeah, we're totally just like breaking his, um, his chains. Ah, okay, thank you and letting him go like it's honestly amazing to me i can't believe that that's what we were doing this whole time and that's why oh that's why i'm not being held back my divine armor is still going i was like why isn't this thing like um slowing me down fucking shit you will uh -huh. damn it if you kind of keep dodging, you'll just barely be able to keep dodging. Or not. Or I can just suck ass at it this whole time and have to do this. Can I? Thank you. I don't know what criteria will let me, like... Cause God damn it! Can I just fucking... Can we just die, please? And I don't know. I don't. Yeah, I don't know what allows me to stay up longer or not at all or whatever. Can you stop doing this, please, so that I can? Oh, that works too. Remember the war in heaven. Remember the rebellion. We shall all witness the end. Okay, what am I doing? Okay, I was like, sorry, I was like, the other one wasn't activating for some reason. I was like, okay, what am I doing? Like, seriously, what the hell am I doing? Okay, of course it's going to be a quick time event, the thing that I'm the worst at in this whole thing. Wait! There's just one last minor detail with which I ought to make you familiar. It can't be. 
You're dead, Dante. You can't go anywhere. Not a single soul may leave this place. It is forbidden by him. I am so sick of you. I will reclaim my rightful place in paradise. My path will be paved with the sins of man, and yours, Dante, shall be the bedrock of my return. And all that is good shall be gone from the universe forever! Not yet. I have collected many souls on this pilgrimage. Souls that I have freed from this inferno. And together, they now possess the power to free me, father, mother, brothers, absolve me! This power, Tante, we can use it together. You and I, friend, just think what we could achieve. I would rather not. Dante, I can reunite you with Beatrice. Together, we will rule the three kingdoms of the afterlife. It's not going to happen. Dante. I did not die, and I did not live. And that has been Dante's Inferno. We have finally uh, resealed Lucifer at the, at the bottom of hell. And uh, but it appears that you know he's we're not done with him because there was the little snake at the end. On I would say that that, that Dante actually made it to purgatory as opposed to heaven because that's just the outline of. Um, the Divine Comedy, but I have no idea. And even though it says to be continued, it appears that there will not be a sequel to this game, which is really sad because I think it would make, um, you know, it'd make a really good trilogy to have the whole um, Purgatory and 
Paradise in there. Although I would hope that they would stick with the Italian names. Even though Inferno, I guess, sort of is an English word also. It's the Italian word for hell. And I would say, like, they should call it Purgatorio and Paradiso. Um, as opposed to the English equivalents of that. But, um, yeah. So this game, it has its moments where it's, you know, kind of not so good. Um, but aside from those, it's... I don't know, I, I like it a lot, actually. It's one of those, like, I don't know, it's just kind of fun to play. <laughs> it's, you know, not super great, but it's not horrible. Um, I wouldn't even call it bad. Like, I've been saying, it's actually pretty, I think it's pretty good. Um, I don't know, it's just a good time. Annoying at some points, but, um, you know, fun in other respects. Anyway! So this has been Dante's Inferno. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching. You're all amazing and awesome people and I will see you later.